this project should be undertaken with parental or adult supervision to ensure a safe and enjoyable experience. Hey, Sammy! Ew, what are you doing there? I wanted to ask Roger for tea and a cake, but it seems to me it's impossible. Oh, now I see why it's such a mess here. But why is it impossible? Did we run out of flour? I can go and get some. Look, here it says, take a small round cake pan. But we only have the big ones! It's all over! <laughs> really? Let's go. I'll show you where we keep them. Hi, guys. Today, we're gonna make a special cake in the form of… No, Sue! Don't tell me! Let me guess. <laughs> Sammy, can I give you a hint at least? If you don't say too much! I'll try to do my best. You can stop me if you want. The big and great cartoon expert doesn't need a hint! Okay, guys. Our cake is gonna be round like a famous Pixar character. He has another bright peculiarity. His color. It's my second favorite. It resembles fresh cut grass on a summer lawn. And now we'll add a pinch of sea salt. Be careful not to add too much. Wait a second, too. But all your favorite colors are different hues of cake! For example, this perfect one that I call Sam's. Just look at it. <laughs> Sammy, you have to accept the fact that the world doesn't revolve around you. Sue, the water is boiling as you asked, but why do we need it? Because it's time for a water bath. We'll heat the mixture to dissolve the sugar and make the batter more stable. Good macaroons, I get it! A round green Pixar character, of course! It's Mike Wazowski! Now I'm going to melt butter and mix it with milk. Sue, I'll take care of that. You can count on me! And you guys can ask an adult to help. The oven is not a toy. The next step is whisk, whisk, whisk. Woohoo! I like this so much. As you can see, the mixture becomes super pale and fluffy. It means that it's almost ready. Is it just me or did you see it too, guys? We need to slow the speed to pop big bubbles. Finally, we're done. Ooh, I think I'm tired. Yes, it seems I need to be recharged. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my Veta Sam, you scared me. Isn't it funny? What was that? Come on, Sue, laugh! Sammy, explain. Mike Wazowski doesn't show up without his friend Sully, so I probably should look like him. Sammy, you look gorgeous just the way you are. Did you melt the butter? What a question! Sure thing! But guys, you need to wait till the mixture cools down. Thanks a lot, my great helper. You didn't explain why you wore that strange outfit. Are you planning a themed party? You said you needed to be recharged! Everyone knows laughter is ten times more potent than screams! Look out! Sammy's on the way! Careful! Uh, uh, great! So, the operation was a success. <laughs> Sammy, you're always on time. It seems you're enjoying making a cake. Let's preheat the oven up to 170 degrees Celsius. Everything's ready for accepting the cake. So, what are we waiting for? Let's go. Guys, stay tuned if you want to see the result as much as I do. Ah, oh, what a smell. Holy cannoli, I'm in heaven. What a surprise. Sammy's near the cake. <laughs> Sue, I have a really important question. Can I have a bite? Only some crust and the excess, which I've already cut off. Be careful with the knife, guys. I hope you'll handle it without me for a sec. I'll try to do my best, Sammy, but I'm not sure, so hurry up. Guys, we need to whisk the cream cheese a bit. I like this process so much. It's like meditation. Oh, Sue, it was wonderful. Heaven in my mouth. We didn't even build the cake yet. I bet you'll be so surprised. Sammy, can you whisk the whipped topping? We will need it later. You don't need to ask. I'm crazy about good frosting. Let's check my new magic trick, guys. If I need to whisk, I'm ready to take the risk. Uh, what? Uh, I didn't mean that. <laughs> Melted butter, eggs and flour, and the frosting I am proud of. Ah, it's no time for soccer. The last attempt. Bibbidi, bubbidi, subscribity! Yeah, finally! Sue, did you see that? I noticed you had some troubles. What happened with the great slime magician? What troubles? I was just testing out new spells. Let me get it out of harm's way. It's a wand after all. Who knows what could happen? But what if I. Whoosh! <laughs> I know some tricks too. Madam, I'm the member of the General Frosting Inspection, and I'm here to check everything. Okay, mister. I understand it should be done. Go ahead. By the mozzarella? I've never eaten anything this good! What are we waiting for? Let's build our cake! 
We're at the finish line, guys. It's time to build a cake. It looks exactly like building a house. The first layer of bricks goes here, and then we'll add some cement. Sue, why on earth did you pour water on the cake? Now it'll be soggy. Sammy, breathe. Everything's thought through. It's simple syrup. Taste for yourself. Hmm, smells like sugar. By the way, do you need it now? I have to inspect it too. You can take it, but try not to finish it. We need it for our cake. Would you look at this beautiful hue, guys? I love it. I'm gonna make a nice and even layer of frosting. The syrup is so sweet! We need to make more the next time. Sammy will deal with it in a moment, so guys, let's speed it up a bit. Sue, I have a very important question. Uh, don't you think that there's too much blue here? You're right. Whoa, much better. Sue, you are a magician! Guys, let's proceed. As you can see, our house is ready. Now we'll carefully put the frosting on the cake and spread it evenly. Guys, you can put as much frosting as you want. Sam, could you put the rest of the frosting into four different bowls? All this time we had more frosting and you kept it a secret? What kind of friend are you? Otherwise you would have eaten it all. <laughs> That's fair enough. Sue, I'm done, check it out. Guys, are you ready to see the real magic? How do you like it, Sammy? Now it looks more like Mike, huh? Sue, can you guess how many drops of food coloring you need to make Mike Wazowski? Oh, that's easy, Sam. Only three. Guys, watch and learn. Sammy, I need your help. Where are you? Sammy, do this. Sammy, do that. And when is Sammy gonna eat some cake and have a rest? Oh, come on, Sammy. I'm asking you because you're the great master of decoration. Decoration? Uh, who's a decoration? I love it. Put our colorful frosting in piping bags to turn a plain cake into a cheerful mic, okay? Is that all, Sue? You could have entrusted me with something more important. Guys, we've already made so many cakes that I don't doubt Sammy could have done it all by himself. By the way, did you see our video with the castle cake? What about the bubbling cauldron cake? Oh, I strongly recommend you watch them all. You won't regret it. Here, Sue. Thanks, Sammy. And guys, we're moving straight- Sue, Sue, you forgot one! You scared me, Sammy. We need to draw a cool mic on the cake top, like this. Don't be scared to make a mistake. You can fix it all if needed. Be careful, and things should work out on the first try. Do I want to try too? Let me help you, please! Okay, why not? Uh-huh. Uh, let it go here, let it go there. Ta-da! What do you think, Sue? Is it good? Wow, it's wonderful. But I want to add something else. Now the cake looks complete. It's just several light movements. Can we eat now? First, let's check it out one more time. I know the feeling, Sammy. I can't wait to eat it, too. This is for you, my dear friend. You did a great job today. I'm so ready for the first piece, woo! First? <laughs> I wonder how many of these he'll eat. Okay, let's try it, guys. Mmm, buy the mozzarella. It's one of the best cakes I've ever had in my life. Hi, guys. Oh, you've already started without me. Come sit here, Raj. The great TV Dabba, I didn't need it all. <laughs> it's good that I'm always on time. Give us a thumbs up if you want more cake videos. Don't forget to hit the bell button so you don't miss our next video. Oh, it's so much fun traveling the world. You never know when you're going to meet new friends. Hello, you guys. Hello. <laughs> oh, oh, the microphone's ringing. <gasps> it's talking. It's minute mate time in the UK. Oh, thanks, Toki. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's minute mate.
Break time! Yeah! That's right. Now, can anyone guess what colour my socks are today? Please. Guesses, please. Come on. All good guesses, mini makers. But today, my socks are. Drum roll, please. Yellow! Yeah! Ah. Now, we need some more socks because we're going to make this. It's a sock pen pot. Very useful for keeping all of your arty things inside. <laughs> now, my friends, we can make one of these by using these arty things. We've got a sock, a pot, a glue stick, some fun fur, a pen and some stickers. Now, do you think it's possible to make this sock pen pot in just one minute? No way! Well, I think I can. I will have to be very quick, but don't worry. I'll remind you how to do it at the end. Are you ready? Yes! Are you ready? Fantastic. Let's make it in a minute. Three, two, one. Start the clock. Right, let's get our sock and our pot. And we're going to put the pot inside the sock like this. And then we put the rest of the sock inside there. Now, let's get our pen and we're going to draw on a smiley face like that. There we are. Right, now let's get some stickers. And we're going to draw dots inside the stickers for eyes. And now let's stick on the stickers. There's one eye and there's another eye. And now let's use these rectangle shaped stickers for teeth. There's one. <laughs> there's another one. And one last tooth. Here we go. Now, let's give our friend some hair. So we've got some fun fur there. Let's stick on some glue like that. There we go. And now, if we turn him around like that, he's taking shape. And we can stick in our lovely hair. And we have done it! Yeah! <laughs> I did it just in time. But if you've got more than a minute, you could try all sorts of ideas. How about a smiley striped pot with blue woolen hair and pink sticker cheeks? <laughs> or a spotty pen pot made from a dotty sock with three eyes and wild orange hair? <laughs> or you could even make a bright orange pot with wild curly pipe cleaner hair. <laughs> sock pen pots made in a minute. Why don't you try it? Here's a reminder of how to do it. Let's go back to the beginning and take another look. Pull an old sock over an empty pot like this. Draw on a mouth. Add dots to stickers for eyes and stick them on. Add sticker teeth. And glue fun fur inside the back of the pot for hair. Your sock pen pot is finished. Why don't you try and make it in a minute? Thanks, everyone, for being part of another marvellous Minute Make! Yeah! the Queen's House, Buckingham Palace. Look! <laughs> oh! Hey, what's this? Ah, it's a Mini Maker postcard. Let's see what we've been sent today. Hello, I'm Isabel from Hong Kong and I made a bird for you. I painted it my bird. I stick the eyes and stick the feather I hope you like it, Mr. Maker. Hello, Mr. Maker. I am Maria from Brazil, and I drew a book for you. I drew a butterfly, and a color in, and I drew a flower. Do you like to read my book, Mr. Maker? Oh, what lovely ideas. Why don't you try one of those? <laughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, some mini makers are calling. Hello, Mr. Maker. My name is Erin and I live in South Africa and these are my friends. Hello! Can you help us make a picture? Oh, what a great idea! I'm on my way. I'll be with you for a high five in... Five! Four! <laughs> We're in South Africa! I made it! Oh. Oh, I told you I would. Right, high five. <laughs> what picture would you like to make? Space. A space picture. Oh, I love outer space. Now, what's going to be in our picture? 
A rocket. A rocket, of course, there's got to be a space rocket. So what will our rocket look like? We're going to look at the rocket. Oh, I see. We won't be looking at the rocket. We'll be inside the rocket. Is that right? Yeah! Wow. So are you all space captains? Yeah! Are we ready to blast off into space? Yeah! Let's make it together. We are making the rocket. Let's paint a planet. Come on, everyone. There we go. Get painting. These are the buttons for a control panel. And we'll need a nice space background. Thanks, Tristan. Well done, Jesse. We're having great fun making our big picture, and that's just giving me an idea. Why don't you make something too? Try making a colourful cosmic control panel. It's great fun to play with on your own space adventure. You will need a small box, kitchen foil and sticky tape, a small piece of card and a glue stick, colourful lids, a pencil and some modelling clay, stickers and a photograph. First, find a small box and make sure all of the flaps have been stuck down. Now take some kitchen foil and wrap the box up like a present. Stick down all the edges with sticky tape. Next, take a rectangle of card and stick it to the front of the box for a screen, like this. Now stick on colourful lids for buttons and knobs. To make an antenna, push the non-pointed end of a pencil into a ball of modelling clay. Then carefully push the pointed end into the box. It's a good idea to ask an adult to help you with this. Add stickers for extra buttons and lights. And to finish it off, stick on a picture or an old photograph like this. But make sure that it's a little bit smaller than the rectangle screen. Ah, oh, what a handsome spaceman. Now your cosmic control panel is finished and ready to play with. What a great idea. Why don't you try it? But right now, let's see what's happening in outer space. Oh, well done, everyone. We made it together! Yay! Just look at the view from our rocket. There are so many stars and planets out there. Wow. We have seen some incredible sights today on our arty adventures. Remember, wherever you are in the world, get making. <laughs> oh, excuse me. It's my phone. Oh, it's Toki. Hello. Time to go. Time to go. Oh, thanks, Toki. I'll be home soon. Oh, well, that's it for now. My making time's over, but yours is just beginning. It's time to put the marvellous maker case back in its box. Hello and welcome to Cooking with Sam. we got a great show lined up for you today. Roger will be out in the fields investigating organic honey. And we've got the lovely Barbie in the studio. Delighted to be here, Sam. I can't wait to tell you my story. Awesome! We'll be chatting about life as a style icon, dating Ken, and all things pink. But first, it's time to cook up a storm. I'm going to make a delicious cake that will blow your mind. Wow! Remember, all the recipes are available in my debut cookbook, Cooking with Sam. Available from all good retailers now. Susan, it's time to start cooking. Mm, where is she? Cut to an ad break. Sam, what's going on? I was in the bath. Sue, we're live on air. Try and be professional. We oui, chef. No, I went to the toilet before the show started. It means yes in French, Sammy. I knew that. Honest. Now let's get cracking, huh? Oopsie, something went wrong. Sam, did you prank me or something? I sure did. <laughs> well, I need a real egg now. Here you go, Sue. It's the best of the best. 
That's how you do it. Hiya! Now we need to whisk it all up. Excellent work, Sam. Now, we'll add cream of tartar. It will help the egg stiffen up. Do you hear me, eggs? Stand to attention at once. <laughs> that did the job, Sam. Thanks. And we'll add some sugar and whisk it all up again. Don't forget the salt, Susan. These eggs will need more ingredients. I'll add a little bit of water. There we go. My favorite ingredient, vanilla extract. Ouch! Here's your honey. Next time, buy it from the store. Thanks, Raj. I really appreciate your effort. Okay, this should be enough. Here I come with the mixer! <laughs> we need this to be light and fluffy! That's enough, Sammy. Stop. Oh! Let me use the spatula to finalize everything. Go on. I will bring the rest of the ingredients. I'm totally ready for the flour. Ha ha. I've got it right here. <laughs> Sam, you have to be careful with the ingredients. Uh... I'm so sorry, Sue. I guess you better do it yourself from now on. All done. Now, I'll add a bit of baking powder. This amount should do the trick. Oof, I know, we're mixing a lot today. <laughs> Sue, I need a break. Pour me some tea, please. There's no tea here, just the vegetable oil. Yuck, what a misfortune. Chef, the cake mix is almost ready. Come check it out. Wow, it looks great, Sue. But how does it taste? Yay! Sammy, you can't eat the raw cake batter. Technically, I just did. Well, don't do that again. We need to put it into cake tin. Very well. Now, I'm going to put this in the oven. And it won't take long. That's the beauty of television. While the cake is cooking, we can get on with our yummy filling. And we will make something special. Great idea, Sammy. I've prepared the mixer. Let's use this whipping cream, then. Mmm, this will taste so good. The mixer will do all the hard work. This is easy. Around and around it goes. It's so hypnotic. Excuse me. I shouldn't have been that close to that. Sammy, are you okay? Am I okay? You tell me. Snap, out of it. Huh? Where am I? What happened? Um... No, no, Sammy, not again. It looks good, and it tastes good too, but let's add some sugar. Wow, what a great magic trick! You're welcome, Sue. That's more like it. Just don't tell my dentist about this, friends. That reminds me, Sammy, did you brush your teeth today? Of course I did. Why would you even ask that? I'm insulted. Sammy, you know what to do? This never happens to other celebrity chefs. It's so embarrassing. Make sure you give them a good scrub. And I need to put our cream into a piping bag. Here we go. Talk about a Hollywood smile, huh? 
Wait, something smells good. It's the cake. Careful, I will get it. Friends, welcome back to the Cooking with Sam show. Oh, please. Maybe we'd better call it Cooking with Sue. No way, you're my assistant. And I have some work for you. Watch and learn, Sammy. Watch and learn. There's something relaxing about this. There sure is, Sue. I could get used to this. Here comes the chocolate fondant. Carefully, like this. Thank you, Chef Samuel. I have an idea. <laughs> Get ready for the good old prank. Huh, I knew it. And not surprised at all, Sammy. So now, I better get rid of the extra fondant. The next step is to give it the right shape. Uh-huh, this way. It already looks good, but there's still much to do. We also need to add several top layers. I'm going to put this on Roger's chair. Surprise, surprise! And I will add some color to our cake. Listen to me carefully. If Roger asks, I was always here. Got it? You can count on me. My lips are sealed. Ooh, this is pretty. This cake is going to be legendary. Well done, assistant. Finally, here comes the upper part. Great! We'll make it look just like a cookie. <laughs> Yay! Our cake is finally ready. Let's make some tea and taste it. Formed a whole dance routine at the beach. I have something for you, friends. This looks amazing. I want to taste it right now. The taste's awesome. Agreed, but I hope it's low fat. Does it matter, Barbie? Friends, subscribe to our channel, give us a thumbs up, and bye bye. Hello, everyone. Are you ready for an arty party? We're in the party pad. It's the perfect place for a party. So, let's get arty! It's the Mini Makers! Here we go! Hello! Hello! Oh, hello! Whoa, hello, Mini Makers! Are you feeling arty? Yeah! Ready, let's party! We're gonna have a party, and look who I've invited. The shakes and straps! He's so excited. All the mini makers are partying too. But most importantly, we invite you! Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one, let's go! Let's get arty, everybody party. Come on, let's dance, everyone! Let's get arty, everybody party! Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one, let's go! Scraps, my friend, it's great to see you. Now, what do you think we should make our party about today? Yes, you have a think. Have you got any ideas? Come on then, Mini Makers, come over here and have a look at the screen. Now, we're going to show you some clues, see if you can guess what our party is going to be about today. What is it? And, oh, what am I doing there? What am I doing? Glasses and oh. around. What's around, Mr. Maker? There, lots of Drawing. squiggles and doodles. What's that? A big, oh, that's a big doodle picture, isn't it? And I'm going to give you one last clue, Mini Makers. 
Ha ha! Doodle, 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 doodle. So many makers. What's our party going to be about today? Doodles! That's right. We're going to have a doodle party today. Yay! Wow, look at that. Well done, Scraps. It looks like you're in the moodle to doodle too. Keep it up. Then, mini makers, we're going to use our noodles and have a doodle party, and we're going to make an arty party picture. Now, what should we use to make our picture? Bottles, string, pipe cleaners, colourful felt tip pens. There's some fantastic ideas there, and in fact, you've just given me a brilliant idea. Let's get arty at our party. Go crazy with doodles to make a brilliantly coloured doodle picture. It'll be a doodly doddle. But first, we'll need some things from... The That's right! <laughs> we'll need some card. A toy that's an interesting shape. Some noodles. <laughs> Wait a minute, Doodle Tube. We need doodles, not noodles. Honestly, I don't know. <laughs> and we'll need some felt tip pens and some crayons. OK, then, Mini Makers, let's start off with some paper or card. And we're going to draw on this around an object. Now, you can use any object you like, as long as it's got an interesting shape. Today, I'm going to use this cuddly toy. All right, then I need a pen, though. Ah, thank you very much, Nathan. Here we go. Let's draw around our shape. There. Let's have a look. Oh, thanks, Jacob. Right, now we need to draw inside the outline of our object with lots and lots of doodles. Now, you can draw whatever you like, shapes, patterns, anything at all. A nice flower to start. And now, the feet. Really filling up now with lots and lots of doodles. And when you've drawn all of your doodles, colour them in. It's all coloured in. What do you think, Mini Makers? Well, thank you very much. And now, Mini Makers, you're going to get your own chance to make your arty party picture. But first, you need to put on your... Arty <laughs> Because it's time to... Start the art! Wow, some great work, Mini Makers, and look at this lovely picture by Iona. What have you made? I've drew uh, around a cuddly cow and added some pink spirals and yellow stars. Wow, that is brilliant. Well done, Iona. And I wonder, has anyone else ever had any arty ideas with doodles? Let's find out. Many years ago, there was a famous artist called Paul Clay. He did all sorts of paintings and was always looking for new ways to create his masterpieces. Oh, I just don't know what to do today. Oh. Then one day, he had an amazing idea. Oh. 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 
trying, I'm trying. <coughs> Quiet, doggy. Can't you see that I'm trying to have a brilliant, amazing idea? <coughs> Wait a minute, that's it. Drawing is like taking a line for a walk. <laughs> right, Paul Clay often drew his pictures by taking a line for a walk. Okay, pencil, walkies. Here we go. Ah, oh yes, right. Here we go. Off you go, go on. Yes, that's it, pencil. That's it, quick, quick, round the corner. Oh, that's it, back, go on, run, go on, off you go. That's it, loops, lots of loops. Very nice. Come on, come on, pencil, come on, pencil. That's it. Oh, yes. When Paul had finished taking his line for a walk, some of his pictures looked like fantastic doodles. OK, pencil, walk it! Whoa! Wait a minute! Wait, wait a minute! Wait for me! <laughs> Taking a line for a walk, eh? Whatever next? Now let's see how the Mini Makers are getting on. <laughs> now, Rochelle, you've drawn around a bunny. What colours have you used? Um, purple and pink. Very colourful. Well done. And Christopher, over here, you've drawn round a teddy bear. Let's look at that. Now, what doodles have you got inside your picture? I have a squiggly line. I have a flower. I, I have some squiggly circles. That is absolutely brilliant. Great doodles. <laughs> Now, Miriam, what's in your picture? Amazing bubbles and seaweed. Yeah. A big old whale and a fish. Oh, look at that. A big old whale and a fish. Very nice, too. <laughs> now, Jonathan, what did you draw around, my friend? I'm this lion. The lion. That's brilliant. Let's have a look. And how have you filled out your picture? I used lots of different bright colours. Bright colours is a great idea if you're making a <laughs> doodle picture. What's that noise? It, I think it's snoring. It, it sounds like someone's asleep at our party. Who is it, everyone? The shapes! That's right. It's the shapes. And I think we should wake them up. So after three, shout wake up. Ready? One, two, three! Wake up! <laughs> Let's dance, everyone! I am the shape! I am the shape! I am the shape! Scraps, let's party! Spin around, spin around, in a circle on the ground. I am a triangle. Clap your hands in the air, triangles everywhere. I am a square. Everybody draw a square, draw it here, draw it there. Everybody draw a square. I am a rectangle. Bounce everybody, bounce like you just don't care. What's it going to be? Later we will see a shape for you and me. I'm a rectangle. Yay! What's hiding behind the rectangles? Can you guess? That's right. It's a book full of doodles. That was fantastic, Rectangle. It's time to get back on the shelf. Yay! 